hello welcome back to my channel if you're new you're welcome and i hope you stay so today i'm going to make one of the most delicious and healthier donuts you've ever tried without wasting time let's just get started so to start i will get a bowl and come in with about 100 milliliters of full cream milk next i will come in with about a teaspoonful of sugar a pinch of salt to taste, some vanilla essence, dried yeast, and here I'm using about 10 grams. I will go ahead and give it a gentle mix. I will drop in a medium sized egg. I will come in with 300 grams of all peppers flour. And I will just go ahead and mix it up. Next, I'll come in with 50 grams of unsalted butter. And with the help of my hands, I'll make sure I incorporate it into the dough very well. So I'll just go ahead, knead and make it into a bowl. I'll grease the same bowl with some oil then put in my kneaded dough I'll cover this up with a plastic wrap and then cover it up with some kitchen towel set this aside for about an hour and 30 minutes so it's been after an hour and 30 minutes and as you can see it has tripled in size so i'll get it out of the bowl and put it on a board i'll divide this into about eight pieces I'll take each piece, give it a little knead. Now I'll get my ring donut cutter. Those I got from Timu. And this is the first time I'm trying it actually. So basically I'll just press it onto the dough then you know you need to apply some pressure to you know cut the shape perfectly so i'll go ahead repeat the process till i run out of dough So as you can see, my ring donuts have been cut over here. I'll just cover it up with a clean kitchen towel and let this rest for about 30 minutes. So while this is resting, I'll get a pan and come in with some oil. It should be enough to cover up the donuts. When the oil is hot enough, I'll drop in my donuts. Don't forget we're doing this on medium fire. So basically I'll fry one side till it turns golden brown, then I'll flip them over and fry the other side as well. So as you can see, they are ready. They look delicious. So I'll just go ahead and get them out of the hot oil. Mm 
I'll go ahead and fry the second batch. So while the donuts are still warm, I will just drop them in some sugar. As you know, I did not put so much sugar in it. This is optional. If you don't like sugar, you can do without it. But I will just coat them with some sugar to make the classic ring donuts. And afterwards here we are guys look at how soft it is it is so soft and it's so delicious you definitely need to give this a try it is easier to make it is healthier than the ones you buy from your fast food joints and I mean it is more authentic Look at the inside guys, this is super soft and it melts in your mouth. You would definitely need to give this a try. If you do, let me know how it comes out for you. If you've not subscribed, please do not forget to hit the subscribe button. Don't forget to share this with family and friends and don't forget to leave me that big fat thumbs up. Until next time, I am going to see you again with another nice and interesting one. Bye bye.